Okay, so hi, I'm um, Jo Thomas and I've been with the Eye to Eye Skit since September of this year and I'm currently a trainee in modern foreign languages. I'm teaching French and Spanish. I'm a career changer um, because I've been working actually in education as part of the Department for Education for over 20 years um, and I've always thought about teaching. I really enjoyed teaching English as a foreign language when I was studying modern foreign languages at university. I also spent a bit of time teaching English in Japan and I really love being around um, young people and I think having had that background in education policy I really wanted to have a go at doing, you know, seeing life on the other side, uh, being a teacher and really helping all children to, to achieve their full potential. It was really important to me to uh, look for a school-centred initial teacher training which is what i to i offer. I did look at a few other providers locally but I was really drawn to i to i particularly because of the range of schools that they work with in the area and a real sense that the, the work they do is very much research based and I could really see that that comes through very strongly in the training and also um, the way that we are placed in schools and, and really made to or help to feel like we are a part of the school right from the, the get-go. I work with another tutor, I'm part of a tutor group um, and of course since we started training we learned that Ofsted had come in and inspected the I2I and it gained its outstanding so definitely uh, the right choice. Um, I'm finding the trainings going really well so far. We're currently about three months in, uh, which is not that long, but uh, it's going really quickly. And actually, I already do feel like a teacher. I'm teaching 10 full lessons a week um, and, and really enjoying that uh, and, and just really benefiting from the support that I'm getting uh, within the classroom. I think the best bits for me um, are really when a lesson goes really, really well. Um, you can see almost that kind of light bulb moment when the sometimes quite tricky, in my case, grammar points for languages that you're trying to get across uh, have really landed and, and there's that kind of aha moment. And that's a really lovely thing to see. Or sometimes also when a student asks a particular question or makes a connection to something they've already learned, you can really tell that what you've taught has really been understood and, and been learnt well. And that's just such a lovely feeling when that happens. So those are my best bits. Uh, in terms of what's more challenging, um, that it is a busy thing to do, uh, to train to teach and obviously to, to be a teacher, there is a lot um, to do. But I think the key that I've found is that you know, there are lots of resources available. Uh, so if you work smartly, you have to be quite organised and, and plan your work. But there certainly isn't the case that you have to do everything from scratch. There's, there's resources available that certainly within my faculty, everyone's really keen to share and help. So that, that can be a bit challenging. Um, Behaviour is something that I worried about uh, before I started. Again, the training really gives you some excellent um, advice and, and methodologies to 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 try and, and actually it's amazing how well those work um, in the classroom setting. So work in progress on that sometimes. Uh, we are working with teenagers after all, but um, uh, I definitely support to, to help with those things. Um, in terms of advice that I would offer to anyone thinking of uh, becoming a teacher, I would say do it. Uh, if, if you're thinking about it, I, I say I thought about it for quite a while and I'm so pleased that I've made the decision to, to do it. Coming as a career changer, I'm certainly not alone in having had a career and then coming into something. Um, I, I loved my previous job, but knew I wanted to, to do something different and, and give teaching a go. And um, I, I think it's incredibly energising to come later into a, into a new career. Um, so I would say just, just do it. Find out all you can about the different providers in your area, about the schools in your area talk to people who are going through training, uh, but definitely if you think you might want to do it, I would say go for it.